Hello, I'm going to do the Capricorn Weekend Energy for May 8th and 9th. And this is a general reading, so this may or may not resonate for you. All right, we're going to pull some tarot, we're going to get some clarifiers, and then close out with an oracle. Also, you have the power to change my life for the better by liking, subscribing, and watching my videos all the way through. Even if you just pop them on in the background, I would greatly appreciate that. All right, we have Queen of Swords, we have Six of Swords, we have Eight of Pentacles, and we have Four of Wands. I feel like there's some change coming in for you. I feel like there's definitely some change and a new direction for you. Could be a change in attitude. Um, a change in perspective. It could relate to yesterday's reading. Yesterday's reading was three wishes and it was like, <clears throat> which I thought about afterwards, I was like, you know, um, what are those three wishes? If you could have anything and you have three wishes, what would those wishes be? And to focus on those and focus on that energy. <clears throat> and I feel like maybe today, Maybe that has affected you, affected you in a positive way, and you're you're moving towards those wishes. You're reaching, moving towards those goals, and you've had a shift of energy. Oh, look at that! If that doesn't say a shift of energy, I don't know what does. <laughs> yeah. So we have the Death card. We have the Ten of Wands. We have the Five of Swords. We have the Hierophant, we have the Ace of Cups, we have Judgment, we have Justice, we have King of Cups, we have Herm the Hermit, we have the High Priestess, Nine of Wands, and Two of Cups again. I feel like the Two of Cups came out in yesterday's reading, um, the Two of Cups came out in that same spot, but I can't exactly remember. And I do remember I do remember two of cups came out and I feel like your energy has shifted you've let go of things you've decide you like you've become stronger you become more positive you've had an awakening you're feeling more alive you're feeling like I'm going to do this I'm tired but I'm gonna keep pushing through because I believe that things are going to move forward for me and it could be a relationship and it could be that you've since you've changed this attitude and you've changed your energy that there's a relationship that comes in for you because your energy has changed and I almost feel like you're becoming more independent and you're looking out for yourself and you're making those choices that are best for you and your your choice in your next relationship I feel is going to be one that is a better choice than what you had before because you realized what you don't want to have and when you start a new relationship, you're going into it confident and you're going into it knowing what it is that you want and that you want an equal partnership in a relationship. Or if it's a new relationship that you've started, that um, you want it to be more balanced and feeling more equal. Um, but I'm kind of getting the feeling that this is a new relationship that's coming in for you. But you're going into it with 
more of a positive attitude and knowing what it is that you want and what you don't want because you've taken that time to see clearer and you're listening to your inner voice and you are making those choices that are right for you. I, f I feel like for some of you just it's a change of attitude and a change of an outlook. Um, let's see. What card do I want to... Maybe Angel Answers. I feel like in this new relationship, you're just going to go with the flow more. Like you're going to just let things happen. That you're not going to put... You're just going to have a good time with the person. Maybe before you were trying to rush things and you were trying to put those things into a box and you were trying to um, put titles on it. And this time around, you're like, hey, I'm just going to go with the flow and I'm going to see what happens. I'm not going to rush into anything. And I'm going to see if this is the right fit for me. We have let go. Let go, that's exactly what I was just talking about, is let go, let, letting go of putting titles on something, letting go of trying to control a situation, letting go of putting, you know, maybe having those, well, you know, any rules or any guidelines that you maybe used to follow before. But obviously, if you feel that there's red flags, if you see there's red flags, that's a different thing. But I feel that this is more about just having a good time because I keep focusing on this king of cups it could be a water sign that's coming in but I feel like the king of cups is somebody who just goes with the flow who just lets things happen and we've got this two of cups and we've got this fish coming through here and there's there's like a lot of water around it so it's just it's calm waters it's it's just looking eye to eye and just letting things happen. Don't try and control anything. Just If you go out this weekend with somebody, just have fun with it. Just enjoy that time that you spend together. Or if there's somebody new that comes into your life, just enjoy it and just have fun. All right. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great weekend and I will see you on Monday.